I'm Adam Azer with Doug Kroll, the baseball editor for NCAA.com. We continue our College World Series preview as we take a look at the Fresno State Bulldogs. This is the first four seed ever to make it to Omaha. Doug, what a ride it's been for the Bulldogs. And it's not like they've had an easy road either. No, certainly not. They've beaten some really good teams along the way, coming out of that regional of death in Long Beach, and then moving on to beat Arizona State in three games on the road. If there's one team that's earned the right to be here, it is Fresno State. Yeah, the stat sheet doesn't really tell the whole story with this team. As a team, they hit under 300, don't steal a lot of bases, don't hit too many home runs either. So how are they doing it? Well, clutch hitting and timely relief. It seemed like they cashed in on so many opportunities in Tempe. And then when they needed their bullpen the most, they turned to guys with ERAs in the sevens who still got the job done against one of the best offenses in the country. And since Fresno State isn't as talented as the other teams in Omaha, they're going to have to continue doing that, making the most of opportunities, just like they have been doing recently. The Bulldogs are back in the World Series for the first time since 1991. This is their fourth trip overall. Doug, do you worry about the inexperience? Well, it could be easy for players to get lost in the moment in Omaha with everything going on around them. It's an atmosphere that none of them have ever played in before, so they're going to go up against a Rice team that's now been there the last three seasons, so probably not a great opening opponent for the Bulldogs. That game is on Sunday afternoon. Log on to NCAA.com over the weekend for updated scores. And log on during the week to see previews of all eight teams in Omaha. For Doug Kroll, I'm Adam Azer for CBS College Sports.